Now, my next item is something that I can definitely recommend because I actually bought one of these for my dad last Christmas. It's our personal alcohol breath tester. And let me tell you, this is such a useful gadget, which to be honest, I think is an essential for anyone who drives. I think that these days, thanks to all the TV ad campaigns, most of us are very aware of the drink drive laws and wouldn't dream of breaking them. But the fact is that many drink drivers are the people that never intended to break the law and thought that a couple of drinks would be okay. I usually drink two pints most nights, you know, it varies. I have probably one at the most. Uh, I'll probably have two pints and then still drive home. Um, if I was going to still drive at the end of the night, if I was drinking, I'd probably just have one drink. And what about driving the morning after the night before? Have you ever done it? Uh, yeah, I must admit, I have, yeah. I do have to admit, I have driven after the night before. I have, um, but try not to. Well, with one of these alcohol breath testers, you'll be able to decide whether you really are safe to get behind the wheel. Now, to use this alcohol breath tester, all you have to do is hold the power button in on the front of the unit. Now, you see there, the yellow light lights up, and then in just a moment, the green light will light up. Once you've got your green light lit up, all you have to do is blow into the sensor just on the top here for a few seconds. After a few seconds, the traffic light colored LEDs on the top will light up to show you your current breath alcohol level. Now you can see mine's lit up green. Now that indicates that I have under 0.02% blood alcohol content, which is little or no alcohol has been detected in my system. If it was to light up yellow, that would indicate that my blood alcohol content was over 0.02% and should be taken as a warning. And if you see the yellow and red lights up together, then that indicates that your blood alcohol content is over 0.05% and you have a high level of alcohol in your system and you definitely should not drive.